Hey pretties, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Tania and I film all kinds of pink girly beauty, fashion, and lifestyle videos on this channel. If that's something you're into, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and push bell notifications so you don't miss any of my videos. For today's video, I am doing another Amazon. This is more like Amazon picks, like my top Amazon picks for Prime Day this fall. If you guys don't know, there's another Prime Day happening on October 10th and 11th. Mark your calendars because there's going to be some good deals, including on the items I'm going to share with you guys. The very first item, I cannot hold it up because it is just way too big of a box. So I'm going to overlay my unboxing here. Welcome to my unboxing of the Yidi Cube. As you guys can see, this came packaged very well. Had my husband help me unbox it because it was just a little bit heavy. It was kind of a group effort, as you guys will see here. We both were very, very excited to set this up. The station is so nice and sleek and fits in any space. Here's a power cord which matches the machine, which is so satisfying. My husband attached the ramp for the robot vacuum to go into its little home base. And next we added this little plastic piece that goes on the floor and then we unboxed the vacuum itself. And yes, my husband was very excited to use my pink knife to unbox this. <laughs> and he really does enjoy doing this stuff with me, so it's super sweet. But here is the robot vacuum. She's so sleek and pretty and you can just tell that this is going to just be very nice just by the weight of it and how it looks and feels it did come with the vacuum attachments as well as the water plug and that does have to be installed the right way it also came with the little mop pad you do have to make sure you install the water plug right side up so i did that right here and then i went ahead and attached the little vacuum bristles and i added the mop pad after we set everything up, we went ahead and turned her on and decided to configure everything on the mobile app. That's an upgraded robot vacuum. So with that being said, this is in collaboration with Yidi. This robot vacuum and mop is just a godsend. I have been using a robot vacuum mop for a while and I have not looked back ever since. So here is our new best friend, aka our new robot vacuum in action. We always call robot vacuum our best friend because that's exactly what it is. It's our best friend. It cleans up spills so, so well. I love how it fits really neatly underneath my counters. And it has a really, really powerful vacuum suction that picks up any kind of debris, hair, dust, pet hair off of any floor type or floor surface like carpet, floor, tile, etc. I actually dropped this oatmeal today and it was just the perfect time to film this clip of how well that the vacuuming works. Here she is in action cleaning our floors, left them squeaky clean. Moving along, I do have rugs in my home, so I wanted to show you guys that the Yidi Cube is actually equipped with an 8mm auto mop lifting feature, so it allows it to not wet the carpet, but it also handles all kinds of surfaces like hardwood floors, tile, or marble. I really love how it can really lift up and go over my rugs and not drag them. I think the most impressive part of the Yidi Cube is that it has such strong suction power that it will empty a full dustbin in just 10 seconds and has no hair stuck onto it. It provides 60 days of completely hands-free maintenance, which has made my life so much easier. Before, I always had to be emptying out the bin on my previous robot vacuums. It even has a 104 degree dryer for your mop, so it will be completely dry and it will not create any smells. Right here you can see the power of the mop on the napkin. And lastly, we have this super convenient handle so that you can pick up your robot vacuum and carry it if needed. As you guys saw, that is just such an amazing addition to my household. It makes cleaning so much easier. I do have two cats, so the hair is just... It's a lot, guys, so it's so necessary to have something to upkeep my place and my floors. So I'm going to link everything down below. I, if I have a coupon code, it's going to be overlaid right here. And of course, coupon code links, everything will be in the description box there's gonna be a good deal for prime day so make sure you guys check that out All right now let's go ahead and get into everything else i'm going to take a little sip of my iced coffee here 
look how cute my cup is i got this i think it was like home goods or something you guys saw this if you saw my halloween my spooky haul i made myself a pumpkin spice latte you guys i have a few tech items decor items home items just a little mix of everything i also have some items i can't hold up so we'll talk about those at the end but the first thing i'm going to talk about is you guys i got the new phone 15 if you guys did not see the unboxing i'm going to link it down below you guys need to watch that unboxing and set up in that video i set up my iphone i customized it made it juicy couture and pink and it's so darn cute let me just show you guys really quick before i show you what i'm going to unbox which yes it's a phone case of course it is you guys can see my my theme i'm going to lock it so you can see the lock screen <gasps> it's gorgeous it's gorgeous so i'm going to link my phone theme down below so you guys can get your hands on it let me show you guys this iphone case it is so cute by the way you guys this case is from shein but i got it last year this is for the iphone 13 and it somewhat fits like the camera doesn't fit perfectly but i gone away with it on there like it doesn't slide off or anything so i don't know guys some of my iphone 13 cases fit my iphone 15 and here is what the phone looks like she is so gorgeous like can we not it's so beautiful are you guys ready look at this <gasps> It is so cute. I've been obsessed with the wavy stuff. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about, but like, you know, the wavy aesthetic. <laughs> I call it the wavy aesthetic, but is that even what it's called? Somebody inform me down below it, what this aesthetic is called, but I call it the wavy aesthetic, okay? We are all about the waves over here, so I love this wavy aesthetic. Let's put the case on my new iPhone. Oh my god. I am geeking out about how cute this is. Like, can we not? This is adorable. I cannot wait to do a cute car photo with my phone. Look how cute. If you don't have this, this is under 20 bucks. This case is under 20 bucks. You need it. Even if you don't have like the new iPhone 15, even if you have the pink 13 or any other iPhone, you need this pink wavy theme. Even if your phone is white, it'll still look so cute with this pink wavy case. Link will be down below, girl, because this is way too inexpensive and way too cute to pass up. This is my new favorite phone case. The next thing we're going to open is another tech item. I've really been needing this one, like really, really bad. I broke my other one, was it a week ago? I think it was a week ago two weeks ago i don't know but it's it's broken and i just really need a new one or in college or like you know in school or whatever you would also really need this if you have a um macbook because this is a little adapter if you have a macbook period you need one of these just because the macbook doesn't have very many like slots to put things you know what i mean like it just has two USB-C ports like Sometimes you need to plug in something that's USB and you don't have a USB port. So I feel like everybody just needs one of these if you have an Apple computer or an Apple laptop. But yes, this is what I got. It's a Lantern little adapter. It's called a dongle, but it's really just an adapter that you can adapt or plug in many things to your computer. And let me tell you guys, I have like this big long one that goes on my monitor. Like I use that to plug in my monitor, memory cards, plug in my mouse, my keyboard. But to travel, I don't want to be carrying that big old, it's like this big. It's like a big old block. So I need a travel one. I'm going out of town this Thursday. So I really needed to make sure that I had one of these before I go get on the plane and then I'm not able to work. I work while I travel a lot. It's one of my favorite things to do to edit on the plane or edit at the airport. Speaking of tech gadgets and gear, I got this portable. You guys already saw this if you watched one of my last vlogs, so I'm not going to go on about it. But you can basically plug in a lightning port, a USB-C um, device, and your Apple Watch. I love that I can like charge my apple watch on this because my apple watch is literally always dead so i don't wear it very often because it dies and then i forget to charge it and it's just a hassle to think about charging another device so having this portable to charge my apple watch is just godsend now that i'm in la i get invited to like some events which is really awesome like i'm so humbled and so grateful that i like my job feels like a reality as to where when i was in my hometown my job just feels like it's like it's done social media and like it's not real not that it's not real i know it's real and how much work i put into it but like 
it, I guess in LA, my job is more tangible, is what I'm trying to say. Like, there are things that I can physically do for my job, like go to certain events, make appearances, work with different companies and brands. It's just a very cool thing. It's very different, but I'm not going to ramble on about that. But yes, this is very needed for all of the things that I go to. Sometimes I go to events that are like eight hours long. You need a portable because you're taking content all day on your phone. Like you're just recording. I literally record everything, you guys. So my phone dies easily. So I just need to like juice it up. I need to juice it up in the middle of the day sometimes. Such a nice Amazon find. This was a gifted product, by the way. Just want to like disclaim that. We have another little tech gadget. I've been really into like organizing my workspace and like organizing myself with like my devices and like making everything cute so that I'm motivated to work. So I got this right here. I know you're probably like, Sonia, what the heck is that? Pencil pen um, cover. If you guys don't know, I do a lot of digital planning and I also create all my digital goods on my iPad. I use Keynote to create my digital planners if you guys are curious. I have been wanting to make a tutorial on how I create my digital planner. But honestly guys, it is such a big like thing to teach. Like I feel like it needs parts. If you guys want to see that, let me know. But if you don't, if you're not interested in like making your own planner, I do sell the digital planners I make so I will link them below. Anyway, I love having this because I use this a lot to like design things and like write and whatever. So having like a, a grip or a case for my Apple Pencil, is it pen or pencil? Correct me down below, I just, I can never get it right. So this is by a brand called Moco, Moco like, Moco. <laughs> anyway, that's a funny word in Spanish. Um, if you guys don't know, it means booger. So yes, this is a little pen that I got for for my Apple Pencil. And I saw this all over TikTok and I just had to get my hands on it. The clickiness is so satisfying because I don't know if you guys know, but yes, at almost 30 years old, I'm finding out I have ADHD. So... <laughs> These are the kind of things that I like. I like little satisfying things like that because I'm an easily distracted person. Sometimes feeling like I can like, you know, do something like this, like click a pen keeps me focused for some reason. It's like the strangest thing. But if you're the same, just comment down below. They have it in all different colors too. If you're not a pink girly, like they have lavender, they have mint. I think they have white. So yeah, they have them in all different kinds of colors. But yeah, look how cute all my stuff matches. I just love that so much. This is another essential. So usually on my desk, I just have everything. Like it doesn't have the or proper organization I wish it did. So I saw this. I can't remember who posted this on TikTok, but they had the silver one. And I went on their link and I was going to purchase a silver one just because I need one so bad. But then I saw they had rose gold. So obviously we had to get our favorite color, like rose gold, pink. So this is a little stand and it looks strange. <laughs> it looks strange at first glance, but this little stand will hold all your devices. So you can slide like your iPads and your computers on here. It's like a little divider and you just like, it's a stand, you know, to stand your MacBook and your iPad. So I really needed something like this to organize my devices because I do have two iPads and two laptops so I thought this would at least host my two laptops at least and I might get a second one for my iPads um, and just like sit them next to each other you know for now I just got one to see how it looks but I'm seeing in the back that these little screws are adjustable and I think that's why it came with like this this um, like Allen wrench and extra screws so I think I might be able to adjust it so I can fit literally all my devices on it which is exciting this is a little organizer I got this for my coffee bar to put my like coffee and matchas because I usually just use the bag if you guys have been watching my vlogs I make coffee and I just use the bag so I finally just got this this one has the remaining of my matcha powder in it that's the only thing I've put in it but we do have two other options you can legitimately use this for anything I've seen people use these for candy I've seen people use these for bath bombs or not bath bombs for bath salts like bath goodies bath treats bath salts and bath fizzes which is such a good idea I'm thinking about getting a second one for that but yes I've seen quite a bit of uses for this you could use it for sauces you can use it for salsas like if you have a party so many uses so yes um, I'm gonna use it for my matcha and and coffee powder I don't use k-cups I know I have a Keurig but I 
refuse using k-cups because of the plastic that the particles that get into your coffee it actually has been proven i've done a little bit of research has been proven to affect women's hormones and as you guys know i'm doing my best to take care of myself when it comes to my hormone imbalance so i refuse to use k-cups so i use a little reusable um, bpa free k-cup refillable thing you guys know exactly what i'm talking about i'll overlay it here and i'll link it as well and then i just use regular coffee powder or coffee grounds and that's how i make my coffee on my keurigs yes yeah, this is for my coffee bar here in the beauty room so that i can make my coffees in here decor piece and i'm gonna overlay i did a cute little unboxing reel if you guys don't follow me on like tiktok and instagram definitely go follow me on those I post unique content to each so you guys will always get to see something different. Yes, I got this adorable wavy mirror. As I'm telling you guys, I've really been into the wavy aesthetic, as I call it. We love the waves over here. We are on this pink wave over here, okay? You know what? Hashtag pink wave on Instagram. If you get any of these wavy things I'm showing you guys. This is an adorable mirror. I did see a comment. Somebody said that they would get it if it was lighter pink and I felt the same way. So the picture on the listing, I'm going to overlay it. It was not this dark. It was like a baby pink, which is why I ordered it. And then when it arrived, it was a little darker pink. I still love this shade of pink though so that's okay but i am thinking i'm gonna spray paint it a lighter pink so let me know what you guys think if i should do that or not and if i keep looking at the viewfinder i'm making sure the products are in focus you guys on it right now look at that look at you can see the other side of my closet yes so cute and this was under 20 dollars. the next item i have is a brand new razor headset i'm going to overlay right here i know i already own two razor headsets one for my xbox which is like a, a microphone jack plug-in for the like controller and the other one i have is usb-c and it has little ears my xbox one doesn't have ears so i always kept both because i need both recently got this one because these little ears guys they like pop off and then you can plug in bunny ears and bear ears onto it. So overlaying will be my little unboxing I did to show you guys. And of course, this lights up in RGB and everything. And it's just so cute in editing. Like, can we not? I love this. How adorable this headset is. So this is their new one. And everything about it is so much better. The sound quality. I just, oh yeah, it has like a volume button here on the side. You can mute your mic here with this. This mic is so much better. For doing voiceovers and the one on my last headset for some reason this one just works so much better really really recommend this if you're a content creator or even if you just like to game this cute headset is such incredible quality like it's not just cute i know sometimes when things are pink like this it just looks like it's a toy or like it's not going to be good quality but this is definitely good quality one last um i guess tech thing got this case for my macbook so i actually just stuck this apple sticker that came with my new iphone on here but if you take this off you can see through it a little bit so you can kind of see the apple logo my favorite thing about this listing for this macbook cover in particular because i looked at like a thousand listings it felt like one was definitely like more it cost 20 dollars, but it did come with a screen protector for the screen which is so nice it came with a keyboard cover it came with two keyboard covers actually and it came with these little um, covers for your headphone jack for basically all of the little inputs on the computer. So it has this cover here for the headphone jack. And it also came with covers for the USB-C side, but I obviously don't have those in because I use the USB-C port all the time for like the charger to plug in my dongle. So I normally will not put those on there. I think maybe when I'm traveling, it will be handy to put those in just in case anything spills or anything. It does protect your inputs so that you don't ruin your computer basically so this is what this will look like on my desk it will just hold my macbook and my ipads so i thought i would just show you guys why i got that another thing i guess i should mention it because i get a lot of questions is this apple watch band is also from amazon so i'll go ahead and link it i've linked it in an amazon video before because i got this a very long time ago and hauled it but 
I will link it again. A couple of things I can't really hold up and show you guys um, here at the end. So the first thing being the new wallpaper in my beauty room. If you guys watch my beauty room tour, I will overlay clip here. I have this gorgeous pink damask wallpaper on one wall and that's also from Amazon and it was so easy to install and so forgiving because it's like a peel and stick and it comes right off without leaving any residue so you will get your rent deposit back girl if you're renting. So it is a renter friendly wallpaper so I will link that below you guys seriously it's the cutest wallpaper even if you use it to line drawers or you know to put behind a bookshelf or something it will be so so cute also i think i showed you guys in my room tour i got a new chandelier of course i can't hold it up but that's also from amazon i will overlay a clip right here but this is a plug-in chandelier so if you guys are wanting like a renter friendly hack or something that's easy to install because you're not an electrician like me um well i actually am both i'm in an apartment now and i also <laughs> I'm not an electrician but my husband used to be an electrician so he always did all my light fixtures in our home um, but now um, I can't do I can't break into the, the roof and put a chandelier yes this plug-in chandelier is gorgeous the amount of light it actually like my closet is 10 by 11 like that's the dimensions of the closet so this is a 10 by 11 room and it lights up this room and looks so nice in this room like the size of it so i know that's one of my biggest questions when i buy a light fixture i'm like is it gonna be too small or too big for the room so yeah just so you guys know the dimensions if you have maybe like a baby girl's room a nursery or an office or even if you turn a room into your closet like me that's this is a perfect chandelier for a like 10 by 10 10 by 11 room or smaller if you have a bigger room i would recommend going with like a bigger one but for the most part this is a really really good one and all i did was attach it to the ceiling and i literally put the cord to the curtain rod and i like tucked it behind the curtain rod and then i just plugged it in that's it it's so cute and it really really makes the room like what it is without it it looks so much more sad in here like it wasn't as glamorous i guess i can say okay the next thing that i can't hold up because it's already like in its spot is my new shelf that i put next to my office i did a tiktok of me setting it up and i also did a youtube video slash vlog so i'm gonna link that below but i'll insert clips right here of what that looks like it's just the golden white shelf i have one more item before i forget i got a new skincare fridge so first of all first of all i decided to bring my fridge air skincare fridge skincare <laughs> I decided to bring my fridge or skincare fridge with me and leave behind the one that had the mirror it was white and it had a mirror on it and it would light up I gifted that one to my mama because she loved it she's not a pink really like me she likes pink but she likes mint that's her favorite color so um, I kept the pink one and I gave her the mirrored one so my my pink one so I used to have that one in my office um, which was in a high-rise like building which had big windows that brought in a lot of light and the sun discolored <laughs> my mini fridge and i had no idea until we unpacked it here i think we were moving and it was just so stressful we, we had so much going on i didn't even notice how discolored it was when i packed it the fridge got all discolored which is super sad but yes that's like that made me like not want to display it because it just doesn't look as cute and yes i am very about that judge me all you want but that's how i am okay i like things to look cute so i got a new one of course you would have already seen the unboxing overlaying here somewhere but yes it's by paris hilton it's $50, which is such a good price for a skincare fridge. I looked online and every skincare fridge was like 60, 80, 100, 150, 200. I even saw one for 300 and it's mini. So I was like, girl, no. It was just a combination of what I loved about my old one and why I never got rid of my fridge or one put together. So I never, I love my old one because I had the mirror with the light and then I never got rid of my fridge or one because it was pink. I unplugged it really quickly to show you guys but here she is look how cute she is so cute she's a cutie and the shade of pink is actually perfect love that Paris Hilton is doing all this pink stuff really love it I recently found a tracksuit in Ross and I'm kicking myself because I didn't get it and then I went back and it was gone all right guys that's everything for today's amazon recommendations and must-haves actually no it's not i have one more recommendation so i brought this out to recommend it to you guys at the very end you guys have already seen this before in my last recommendation video 
but I have to share again. So I've been using most of the stuff in that video, like the glasses and stuff. So I'm going to link it below because I think those recommendations are also such good recommendations. So once you're done watching this video, you can go watch that one. But I have to talk about this again. This is my pink tripod. I use this to do all of my TikToks and reels. And it just like very easily like hooks your phone on there and you can tilt it like every which direction like like you could do like flat lays and record like flat and take pictures and set the timer take pictures of yourself this and then i attach a I think i'm just gonna have to overlay a clip of it because i don't know where i have it right now it must be in a purse somewhere because i also take that with me but it is called an obes bought me and basically it's a three-legged little tripod thing that tracks you when you move so if you move it moves with you so if you're recording like a lifestyle video like day in my life and you're like walking this way or walking that way it moves the camera so it's incredible so that thing it comes with the three little legs but the three little legs are not like it doesn't extend like height wise so i attach it onto this tripod and use it that way so those two things must haves absolute must have so gotta have the pink tripod for the height and it's so inexpensive all right guys i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go now this video has probably been long enough i hope you enjoyed all my amazon recommendations for the fall time all right guys love you and i will see you in the next one Mwah. bye